happy Sunday. I haven't left the house all day today because the weather has been grim. So I thought I'm gonna do some festive baking. I'm gonna make some gingerbread and white chocolate chip cookies. I saw them on Tanya Burr's Insta, like Instagram. She has an IGTV, I think, and they looked incredible. So I'm gonna try and replicate them myself. I'm gonna do it with you and I hope they turn out well. So I've got all the ingredients in front of me. I think I'm using the, what is it? The James Patisserie recipe. So it says add 125 grams of unsalted butter. So I'm just using a mixing bowl here and then dark brown sugar. How much sugar? Um, let's have a look, 175 grams. I haven't used dark brown sugar in ages. It's actually really thick. 75 grams of dark brown sugar in there and then beat together until creamy so electric whisk best thing i ever bought for baking honestly i feel like i should have melted my butter first getting creamy guys i'm so excited for these cookies put my festive little apron on because I'm probably going to get this all down me. Merry Christmas, you filthy animals. <laughs> I watched Home Alone last night, so it's in my head. Stuck in my head. Okay. It's all stuck in there. I'd say that's pretty creamy now, though. Um, and then I need to add in your egg and beat again. So one medium, what is this? I think this is actually a large egg. One egg. Pop that down. If using vanilla, Add it now so one teaspoon of vanilla this is optional but i feel like vanilla will always make cookies taste amazing oh it smells so good so i'm using the sainsbury's taste of difference madagascan vanilla extract whoa definitely more than one teaspoon there add in the plain flour ground ginger ground cinnamon ground nutmeg baking powder bicarbonate of soda and salt and build build beat until cookie dough is formed okay so let's do the plain flour first do i have to sift it or sieve it add in okay i don't it doesn't say so if it doesn't say i guess that just means no um so uh 280 grams of plain flour this is just the one that i got in sainsbury's i think it was actually the cheapest and also not sainsbury's tesco sorry um, how much was it again? <laughs> um, 280 grams. So, 280 grams going in. Okay, so ground ginger is one and a half teaspoons of each. This one is new, so I'm going to have to open it. Woof, that is gingery. Wow. Okay. So one, looks like a heaped one and a half of ginger, one and a half cinnamon. Oh, I love cinnamon. I feel like people, cinnamon is like Marmite. Some people either love it or they hate it. I love it, especially mixed with like sweet things like honey or in like a sweet drink. I know some people actually despise it, uh, but I, I love it. It's so Christmassy. And some nutmeg as well. I just got these all from Sainsbury's. Um, so, oof. It's looking very brown. Um, 
brown nutmeg baking powder by carbonate of soda is that so baking powder is one and a half teaspoons let's open this up And a half, and then bicarbonate of soda is half a teaspoon. Don't ask me why, but I think this recipe is going to turn out amazing. So, fingers crossed. There we go, and then what else do we need? Um, and salt. I think this was half a teaspoon, so that's going to be kind of hard to... You know what I'm just going to do? That. And just hope for the best. Beat until cookie dough is formed. So the most exciting bit, guys. Cookie dough. Okay. That is what it looks like. So, oh, it smells so good already. Add in the chocolate chips and beat again until they're distributed well. I feel like I might do a split of chocolate chips and chocolate chunks. Um, 300 grams, okay, that's quite a lot. So how many have we got in here? 100, okay. I'll add 100 of the white chocolate chips. Ooh. That seems like a lot of chocolate, I'm not gonna lie. And then 200 grams of, oh, oh my God, the whole bar, that is a lot of chocolate. Wow. Okay. I'm just gonna break this in slowly. This has been out for a little while as well, so it's not too like, hard, which is good. I don't know, I love white chocolate, but sometimes I do find it very sweet. Like, I don't feel like I could eat a whole white chocolate bar. Like, I feel like it actually hurt my teeth. Whereas a milk chocolate bar, I can eat. And then dark chocolate, I find too rich. It's weird, isn't it? But dark chocolate's so good for making brownies. Mm. Guys, I have high hopes for this. Mm, smells so good. That is what the cookie dough is looking like. Yum. Smells so good. So now, weigh your cookies out into eight cookie dough balls. They're about 120 grams each. Very precise. Okay, so I'd imagine oh, they're going to be very large cookies. A hundred and how much? Oh, exact. Sorry, but that is one big cookie dough. So eight of these. I'm going to have to do them on two baking trays, I reckon. I don't think I've got space in the freezer, so I'm probably going to have to put them in the fridge. Um, oh god this cookie dough is going to be amazing i can just tell like you know you can just tell oh yum 120 exact there we go so three hands are a bit messy so once they're rolled into balls put your cookie doughs in the freezer for at least 30 minutes um or in the fridge for an hour whilst the cookie dough is chilling preheat your oven to 180 um or if your oven runs hot go for 160 70 so mine does run hot so i'm gonna go for 160 okay let's do this so now for the important part. I don't know if actually trying raw cookie dough is that good for you, but. Mm-hmm. 
Oh my god, they're gonna taste amazing. This hasn't got any chocolate on it. So once the white chocolate, oh my god guys. Wow. Mmm. So good. Now for the fun part. Washing up. Okay, I'll stop now. <laughs> So these are the cookie dough. I've taken them out of the fridge and I'm gonna pop them in to the oven. Hey baby. <laughs> hey baby. <laughs> um so 12 to 14 minutes, I think it says. <gasps> oh let's hope these turn out good so 12 to 14 minutes I'm gonna set the timer on here huh what are you i'm making white no what are they gingerbread cookies um gingerbread and white chocolate chip cookies oh hmm. so the cookies are out of the oven they look so good they are a little bit like squidgy but i feel like they just need to like rest or sit for a little while they look really really good moment of truth guys let's see oh my god wow look at the inside of that yum they actually smell really good does it get any more festive than Home Alone 2? No. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. So it's 9.30. I'm at my computer. Just going to join into a Microsoft Teams meeting. I quickly am making a coffee because it's the first one of the day. Start to start to Monday. Then I'm going to sit down with you guys. I need to write a to-do list because I've actually got a lot of stuff to crack on with today. Hello, how are you? Can you hear me okay? I can, can you hear me? Okay, yeah. perfect. <laughs> I'm good, how are you? I mean, I'm finishing for Christmas this week. Are you? Oh. So <laughs> oh, God, I can imagine. Have you been really, really busy? Really busy. I mean, obviously, we're grateful and so lucky that the industry we're in just is booming. Yeah, which yeah, is amazing. yeah. yeah. Um, but it's definitely taken its toll a bit, ready to just have a complete switch on. I can imagine. Oh, so morning meeting done, and I'm gonna write a little to-do list. I always find that writing it down is just so much more satisfying when you can just like tick it off. Um, and yeah, I've got a coffee here. I actually bought some new coffee capsules. I'll show you in a sec. I got them from Amazon, so I'll link them below for you guys grind coffee and oh my goodness like i thought i loved my i think they're pronounced law capsules i just get from the supermarket you would have seen them a thousand times already on like my previous vlogs oh my god these coffee capsules are amazing like this is such a good cup of coffee so i'm very very happy um so yeah i'm gonna crack on and write my to-do list for a productive monday fingers crossed <laughs> so on the menu for breakfast this morning i've just cooked some oats with water and then i'm adding some of this bulk powders vegan I think this is the chocolate peanut one yeah it's so good so i just mix that in in the pan because it tends to fly everywhere if i do it in the bowl and then i'm going to top with peanut butter and blueberries literally been on hold to barclays for 23 minutes how much longer Oh, 
afternoon everyone. So I'm out shooting with hey, Snap Snap Fifi again and we are basically doing a Christmas schlep around London trying to um, shoot some festive outfits and it's so busy today isn't it? It's actually really stressful. It's so, like I think we're going into tier three tomorrow and I feel like the world and his wife has literally come out. But look how pretty Fortnum and Mason looks. Like, it's so, so, so pretty. It actually looks even prettier in real life. Yeah. And it's such a nice day today. Blue skies. Yay! Lots of traffic. This is what we got to contend with. Woo! So, guys, I have come to Zara this morning, got my comfy clothes on. Look at all the festive pieces they have in at the minute. Lots of sparkle. I love these as well. Apparently this is from the woman's showroom. I'm really feeling this colour palette. And I love this as well. How nice. And it's only $25.99. And I have a return to these, so I might pick this up. Good afternoon, everyone. It is Wednesday today, and I am in my Christmas pajamas, and it's three o'clock. That's the kind of day I'm having. To be honest, that's the kind of week I'm having. This week has been. My room is a tip like just look i need to tidy it it's so bad i'm trying to plan christmas content i'm going to do some instagram videos tomorrow i was going to do it today but actually it's too dark like it looks quite bright in my room but it's definitely not that bright so yeah i started to plan stuff and obviously everything is everywhere you would have seen that i went into central this morning i had to go and pick up some food for a i don't actually know how much i can say i really hate to be that annoying person like hush hush but actually the campaign's not going live till january yes yeah, so i had to go in central to pick up some stuff to create some content with and i shot that and i'm gonna go to the gym later it's currently raining outside so i'm gonna crack on with some admin also i bought a 2021 planner the other day can you see that says caffeine and kindness i got it in uh, tk maxx i'll show you it's really really cute so that is the front and then 2021 planner so it's got the dates along running along the side here and so you go into january what i really like is obviously you've got your january goals you write them your january to do's you can kind of like circle important dates here january birthdays that is so important because i always forget little reminders important other dates and then it breaks it down like a calendar like this which i really really like and then you've got days here and like the option to do little to-do lists so i thought that was really good and yeah i've got really nice quotes in it um so i just thought this was really cute i think this was 9.99 as well so guys i've literally had the busiest day and i have not even picked up my camera to vlog today has just been so so busy i've had instagram content to shoot i filmed a youtube video so that would have gone up already basically a christmas day outfit video kind of festive outfit so go have a watch of that i will link it here so i did that and then i filmed uh, a reel for instagram as well kind of a condensed version and then i had to shoot some content for a campaign that i'm working on so i've been busy 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 i actually finished at four and that was the first time that i had eaten all day um and now i'm gonna go to the gym i haven't been since monday um, and then I'm going to come home and edit some content. So busy, 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 busy. Tomorrow I am definitely going to have more of like a chilled 
relaxing day. I've kind of saved like all my ad money bits for tomorrow. So I've got to go to the post office. Um, I really want to make those cookies again. So the cookies that you saw on Sunday that I was baking, the gingerbread and white chocolate ones. Oh, sweet Lord. They are the best cookies I have ever tasted in my life. And I'm not blowing my own trumpet here. Oh my goodness, guys recipe will be below you have to bake them if that's one thing you do this christmas please bake those cookies so yeah i'm gonna go to the gym now i've got some salmon in the fridge from what i had yesterday so at least i don't have to worry about faffing around and cooking when i get home and yeah i hope you're having a lovely week i can't believe that tomorrow is going to be seven sleeps until christmas that was the most unattractive face ever. Happy Saturday, everyone. So I am in my comfy clothes. I've just got this oversized Zara hoodie, which I'm wearing in a medium. It's like the coziest thing ever. Really big hood, that fleecy lining. And then my Adenola leggings on, honestly. I cannot believe that I've only just discovered these leggings. They are like butter soft. I love them. So I'm just going to stick my trainers on. I've got an ASOS return to do and a bag of returns to do there. So I'm just going to have some breakfast quickly, head to the post office. I reckon the queue is going to be around the block and I'm just going to have to grin and bear it, unfortunately. Run some errands. And then later on, I'm going to go to the gym and I'm going to start my Christmas wrapping because there's a huge box over there full of Christmas presents that I need to start wrapping. I need to get, I need to get some more paper, some like ribbon, some name tags and also some gift bags. I'm going to get that whilst I'm out as well. I am sat on the bedroom floor for my fellow London people. Boris announced a couple of hours ago that we are we are now in tier four which means that christmas is officially cancelled so on that note i'm gonna go and make myself a very large gin and tonic and i'm gonna end the vlog here because quite frankly like if i don't laugh i'll probably cry so yeah i think i'll be spending the next few weeks just drinking my way through So I'm going to end the vlog here and come back tomorrow and just hopefully be more positive for you guys. But sending you all so much love. I know it's such a crap time. 